There's loads of elastics on the market these days. One of the best you can get is the new MIDI shot core elastic. It's available in five sizes and these five sizes will cover all the fishing that you want to do. Really good quality elastics and they're durable and they'll last a long time. Some sort of elastics can perish over a couple of months but hollow elastics, because of the way that they're actually made, they'll last six months if you look after them, treat them with a little bit of lubricant and a little bit of care. The solid elastics have actually got a hollow inner core and this inner core is made from latex with a bright fluorescent surround which makes it stretch really well. Solid, solid elastics actually bottom out quite quickly and can result in hook pulls and things like that. Whereas the, uh, the shock core elastic, because it's hollow, has got a lot more stretch and it's a lot more forgiving and now we just use a, a sort of one size for a range of different styles of fishing. Now the five sizes that are available in the range talk for them and what their actual uses will be and when you'd use each one and which circumstances and things like that and which baits are probably more suited to. The first one is the one to five which is the green one and this will be used for, I use it a lot for roach and skimmers, um, I use it on the drains and on canals and stuff and as well as on commercials just for smaller fish. I'd use probably an 08 and 010 hook length with this and a small hook an 18 or a 20 when I'm fishing on maggots and pinkies probably casters for some shallow fishing for silvers but it's really good it's not it's not ideal for carp and I wouldn't use it if I was targeting sort of eight pound fish because it, it's just going to stretch everywhere and you're going to struggle with land fish it is suited to small fish but it's absolutely perfect for it but there is a backup as of all the hollow elastics they do stretch a long way and if you do hook a bonus fish then you can cope with it if you're catching little skimmers and little roach and you hook a bream that'll be able to handle it perfectly second one which is the orange one, which is four to eight, is massively popular for F1s. It's really good in winter when you're catching sort of pound F1, two pound F1, that every fish counts in winter. It's not like you're trying to catch really quickly. You're just looking to hook a fish, carefully ship back and play it. Use a puller bung, which is really important because it helps you use a lot of elastic, still land big fish. And you actually use that and you can land every fish you hook and in winter probably a pound will be the difference between winning a match and coming nowhere so it's really important to use a light elastic in winter when fishing for f1s and skimmers and things like that and that is perfect absolutely brilliant for that now this is my favorite elastic and it's probably my, the most popular one if i was going to pick one elastic to use all year round for every size of fish it'd be this one it'd be the six to ten um the yellow one it's absolutely perfect for all round fishing so, sort of, I use it for carp if I'm fishing shallow because you can hook them and they can run out your swim and they're not splashing about spooking the fish that are already there. I use it for skimmers on the drains when I'm fishing chop worm. I use it for perch. Really is versatile and it's a great elastic. Again, you use a puller bung just so it enables you to have a little bit more control when you hook fish and you're sort of playing them under your feet. Um, and you're not trying to land it with loads of sections up in the air. Pullerbung is really, really important for that. But it's, it, in my opinion, it's the best elastic for a venue that you're not sure where you're going to catch. If, you, if you're going to a venue and people hear from one person that they're catching bream or they're catching tench or they're catching carp or skimmers, you're not quite sure, put that in your pole and you're going to land everything that you hook. Now stepping up, you're looking at elastics now that you can land probably double figure fish for and beyond. 12 to 16 is my bagging elastic. I'd use this when catching small carp um, and you want to catch them quickly and you want to land them quickly and you're looking for big weights, probably 100, 200 pound of fish. Or as I said, also if you're looking for big fish. So that's normally my margin elastic because you can hook the fish in the margins, just stir them away from any snags and then you can play them out in the open water. And it's really good for, um, like probably five or six pound fish that they can be really sort of aggressive when they're fighting and they can fly out all the, all the time. Bigger fish tend to plod about a little more, more and use their weight but those five to six pound fish they just tend to be a bit crazy and you hook them you'll fly out your peg it's got a lot of stretch so it'll absorb that first run then it'll quickly get them into control and you can net them quite easily again with a puller bung. And finally this is a proper proper big fish elastic it's really strong and again I'd use it for margin fishing where there's a little bit more snags or fishing against reed beds or fishing against probably a tree lined far bank where there's a lot of roots 
and you want to hook a fish and you know that you just guide it away and it's not going to run too far. I mean this elastic is what Pete Upton's used recently to win the match this final, catching double figure down, fish down the edge at Larford. And this elastic's just won him £65,000 so it just shows how good it is and shows that people's got the confidence to use it in big matches when every single fish counts. When you know that catching a double figure fish can be the difference between coming nowhere or winning absolutely thousands of pounds, that's the elastic that people choose. With each spool of shot core elastic, you also get the elastic protector. And these are absolutely brilliant just to protect your elastic and ensure that it lasts a long time when your top kits are being stored. Quite often, if you don't use one of these, your sharp end of your top kits can actually rub on your elastic when they're being transported and they're sliding about in your tubes. What this does, just pushes between the two and slots in your top kit then that way it stops any friction and protects them and makes them last a long time. These shot core elastics, they're really good value for money and if you look after them, you might need to change them once or twice a season, which when you compare them to some other solid elastics that you do need to change more regularly, they can be a really worthwhile investment. But they're the five sizes, hopefully you've got an idea of when to use them, but check them out in your local tackle shops, really good, they're very really long lasting, absolutely brilliant.